So it's only right in the birthplace of the culture. It's also the same place to launch the first African American woman to run for president. The first African what? Yeah, we changing the culture again. No, the fuck we ain't. So if you never voted before, make sure you get out and vote right now because it's the real one. And in the words of my brother Takeoff, let me get a come on up. Quavo, 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 Quavo. Who the fuck gave you that to say? Who the fuck wrote that down for you for you can get up there and say that bullshit? You know she ain't African American, right? You know she really ain't one of us, right? How much did she pay you? Or did she suck your dick, bro? Let's let we we gonna start right there. She most definitely a head honcho. What did she must got that some hawk to it, spit on twist, motherfucking Tomorrow. She got you too? You know motherfuckers ain't rocking with that shit, right? You know you know a lot of people looking at you like this, right? So keep takeoff name. Bro, that's don't put takeoff name in no shit like this, bro. Cause he if he was still here, he fuck around would have took the fuck off away from your ass. Real shit. He probably wouldn't even be supporting this shit, folks. Donald Trump, on the other hand, has been talking a big game about securing our border. But he does not walk the walk. Or as my friend Quavo would say, he does not walk it like he does. Bitch, you ain't here. And Pamela, I mean, that Kamala, Kamaya, Kamala, why you over here trying to talk about Trump and the border, which is your ass what the borders are? And you let over 10 billion people over here. Bro, made this shit make sense to me.